clip too. There's more watermelons. This is in an individual's yard here in Valdosta, Georgia. Isn't that strange? I'm talking about real live watermelon. Now, these won't be coming from Florida on the back of a truck. These was grown right here in the city limits of Valdosta. These are not even county watermelons. These are city grown watermelons. Check that. Have mercy, Jesus. And then, as I started recording, hey, y'all not going, but there's a lot of them. There's a little one. There's a lot of them. But guess what else he told me? Now, can you believe a black man talking about he got cotton in his front yard? Let's just see. I will see if I tell you the truth. Look at there. Got cotton growing in the front yard. That means his ancestors didn't get enough of picking cotton. And so he growing some in his front yard. And we're going to come back with him. Why, why I tell you the truth? Why you do that, my brother? Why do you do this? Man, this is interesting to me. I just like things different. Uh -huh. you know? And, uh... What? That cotton field over there fascinated me because I grew up in Mississippi when I was a kid. Yes, sir. And, uh, man, when I seen that cotton field, I got me some cotton seeds. I've been planting them every year. Every year. That's every so beautiful. Year. That's so beautiful. Every and I see you got some more watermelons over there as well, oh, don't I you? I got some over there. I got them in the back. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah. What kind of tree is that right there? Oh, my goodness. You need Let's to, walk over here. That's a lemon tree. You oh, my seen, goodness. you never seen so many lemons. Wow. Radio friends, I mean, uh, radio friends and YouTube watchers. Now this is what I do, and I've said it to you over and over again, is that when I find something interesting, I want to bring it to you. Now look at here. And we're not in Florida, y'all. I know you all think we're in Florida. Nope, this is not Florida. How, how long have you had this here? Was here when you moved here? No, no, I planted that. That was a baby. I oh my planted goodness. it. And that's not that they get that big. Wow. They're so big, they look like grapefruits all the time. Uh-huh. And, and, and here in Georgia. Now when you say that, that is, is to show that we are, it is getting warmer, that global change, because long years ago, these wouldn't grow in Georgia, would they? No, no. I, they wouldn't grow? No, no, no. no. So if, if, if people can deny it, but it is what it is. What else I see over there? Man, I got Are those it. cucumbers or what? See, I'm from here, the country myself. I don't know what this thing here is. Mm -hmm. it grew up, I don't know what seed my wife put down there uh -huh. to grow this melon here. Oh, that, okay. It must be a honeydew melon or something. Okay. Okay. I, I don't know. It well, we'll, we'll see, I guess. <laughs> Lord have mercy. You know, I, I, I'm just all out done. I'm all out done today. That's a Mississippi plum tree. A Mississippi right plum tree. Check that now. When I brought it here. It was like that. By what now? Like, like what now? Show me again. It's about that high. About okay. three feet okay. high. Now, it okay. hasn't bared. Okay. But let me ask you a question now. Have the city issued you a ticket or something for growing watermelons in the city limit yet? No, no. No, they have. They haven't. Okay. They probably won't. <laughs> oh well, my I God! I didn't know. Look at that. More, more watermelon and grapes. Oh yeah. Oh my God! Now you know that just go to show you. You can take the man out the country, but you can't get the country out oh. the man. <laughs> and, and that started with three little strings like this. Okay. Okay. Three little. Strings. Now, how many years they been barren? By how many? Uh, years? I've been here uh, going on four years okay. in October. Okay. And I bought that right after I first moved. Here. Wow. It don't take them long to bear now once you oh, get it. it does. Okay. Thank you very much. And what's your name once again, my uh, brother? Langford. Langford. I Langford. really appreciate you so much for allowing me to do this. And uh, all my YouTube watchers, I was just, I saw that sunflower, uh -huh. and then that sunflower led me to all of this. Well, I'm Aren't, glad. Yes, sir. I'm glad you came back. Thank you so much. I'm glad you This is kvci.blogspot.com. George Boston Rams saying bye-bye. We're gone. I told y'all before, I'm going to give it to you. Didn't I tell you? <laughs>